Hello, welcome back to the channel, Cook and Barbecue 24-7. Today I have a great recipe I'm sharing with you and I'm looking forward to it. If you like these type of videos, please consider hitting subscribe, the like button, and share with family and friends on social media. Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're making crispy flounder in our Instant Pot Vortex Air Fryer. Just a very simple recipe with some few key ingredients. We got the fresh flounder here that I've cut up in small pieces. I have a, a cup of the Louisiana fish fry mixed with a cup of plain panko breadcrumbs. Then I have a egg wash mix here. In this egg wash mix, is a, it's a quarter cup of milk, one egg. And then I did a teaspoon of the Tony Satry's no salt seasoning because our Louisiana already has a seasoning in the fish fry mix. So I added some more no salt Tony Satry's a teaspoon of black pepper. And then of course we have our pan spray. Once we get everything battered, get in the air fryer basket. We're gonna hit it with a little bit of oil to get it nice and crispy. So here we are guys, I'm about to mix everything together. Egg wash goes with on top of the fish. And that's the egg wash with the seasoning in it. And all I'm gonna do is gently stir this up to get all the fish coated with the egg, egg wash and the spices. And my air fryer has already been preheated. I'm gonna run 400, get it nice and hot and crispy, cook it fast. I think that's just about it. Everybody's coated. And now I'm just gonna put pieces into the batter, shake it up real good and put it in the air fryer. I'll be right back guys, I'm gonna get you a better angle of the air fryer. All right, we're about to start batter. We're just gonna do about, I said six pieces. We don't want to overcrowd the cooker. So I'll do eight. Five, six, six. And this is two pounds of flounder. And of course, my, after in the description, I have a the exact recipe to this. So you guys don't have to guess anything. The exact recipe will be down in the description. And I'm just going to hit it with a little bit of oil. And now we'll put it in the air fryer. We've got our air fryer set. Air fryer 400 degrees. It's already been preheated, so she's ready to go. And guys, I'm going to just keep you guys in the loop. I'll be back in about... Uh, I say three to four minutes. I'll bring you guys back when I check on the fish. Don't want it overcooked. First time cooking fresh flounder like this. So we want to keep eye on it. Don't want it to burn. Be back in three minutes. All right, everyone. It's been around three minutes. Let's take a look at it. Oh, yeah. Everything's looking good. Of course, it's not done yet, but it's coming along good. I'm going to give it another four minutes and we'll take another peek at it in a few. But it's looking good. It's smelling good, too. All right, guys, let's take a look. It's been about nine to 10 minutes total. Let's take a look and see how this fish is getting nice and crispy and golden brown. Oh, wow, it's looking good. A couple pieces are so kind of soft. I'm gonna go a few more minutes and I think we should be done. It's a few minutes and I did not flip them, so I think we should be fine. So I'm gonna go a little bit longer and I'll bring you guys back um, and go from there. But they're, they're looking real good. Guys, we're back. The fish has been cooking for about 14 minutes now. I'm gonna stop and, and take a look at it. 
I think we should be done. Oh wow, looks real good. Hope you guys can see it. Listen to nice and crispy. Here you guys got it, man. Fresh air fried flounder on the Instant Pot Vortex. I got another batch. Like I said, I had two pounds. This is about a pound. I got another batch to fry. But and you, all you do is to follow the same steps and you have your other batch of fish fry. The final pitch is coming. Guys, thank you guys for watching. Please hit the like button. Please subscribe. Air fried flounder. Cook and barbecue 247. Thank you.